What's up world, it's Dallas with Gadget Hacks. And today I'm going to show you how to get rid of those annoying pop-ups that always show up on a Galaxy S5 to remind you to check the covers on the back of the phone in the charging port. These pop-ups are there to ensure that the IP67 waterproofing certification remains intact. It's Samsung's way of letting you know that they're not responsible for your own negligence if you get water damage when one of these covers was open. I don't know about you, but you don't ever have to tell me twice, let alone every single time I unplug or reboot my phone. I've heard reports that the Sprint and Verizon variants of the GS5 give you an option to disable this message once you've seen it a few times. The T-Mobile and AT&T versions, however, do not give you this option by default. But where there's root, there's a way. Developer Gert Yananima has created an exposed module that lets you easily disable these annoying messages. Just search Exposed G TouchWiz on the Play Store to get the module installed. When it's done installing, you'll get a notification from Exposed telling you that the module is not activated yet. This could be just me experiencing this, but so far I've noticed that this notification doesn't show the usual activate and reboot button on my GS5. But that's okay because all you have to do is tap the notification and it takes you to the Exposed installer where you can enable the module. To do that, just tick the box next to Exposed GTouchWiz. From here you can head to the Framework section of Exposed and tap Soft Reboot to make the module become active. Okay, so once you're back up, just open Exposed G-TouchWiz and have a look around. There's a few other options that can customize different aspects of Samsung's manufacturer's skin. You can disable S-Finder and Quick Connect, or even set custom text for those options. There's also a toggle that will remove the notification header and the clear button in your notification tray. But the options we're mainly concerned with today are the last two. Just toggle these both to on, and after a reboot, the phone will finally start minding its own business and quit nagging you about stuff you already know. But for more tips and tricks like these, not to mention a full step-by-step -step guide on this particular module, be sure to check out the link in the description below. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, guys. But until then, happy gadget hacking.